How to verify your Coursera ID. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel Help Deck. In today's video, I will simply show you how you can verify your ID or your identity on Coursera. So make sure to watch the video till the end. Now some courses on Coursera which could be free or which could be paid or which had a degree associated with it will require you to verify your identity for legal purposes. And in order to do this, first of all, make sure you're logged into the Coursera website which is Coursera.org. I'll also make sure to drop a direct link down in the description below. Once you go to Coursera.org, from the very top right hand side, you'll be able to see your name. So just click on your name and you'll see all of these options. Here you want to simply go to the option called settings. And once you go to settings, you make sure you're under the account page and when your account page, under it, you'll have to find the option called verify your ID. Now keep in mind that you'll only able to find the option called verify your ID if you are currently enrolled in a course that requires to verify your identity. So if I go to the health center over here of Coursera website, which is official Coursera support, and it says verify your ID. To get a certificate, you'll need to verify your ID and it says how to verify your ID. Of course, we need to go to settings as we did. Scroll down to the ID verification section and as I said, you'll only see this section if you're enrolled in a class that requires it. So currently, I'm not enrolled in any of the questionnaires or any of the class that requires me to verify my ID. But if you are enrolled, then you have to click on the verify my ID to start the process. And here's how the verification process will go. It's very simple. You have to simply enter your first and your last name, birth and the country your ID is actually from. So it could be a legal details, not illegal or nicknames, but you have to verify with legal details as well as if photo of your ID it could be passport it could be driver's license or it could be your national citizenship card and after that you have to also make sure to enter and uh, submit a photo of yourself and your government ID must be verified before you can upload a selfie if there is an issue with either of these steps you'll be able to try again and you only need to complete ID verification once to get a certificate for any course or program you take now there are different other details that you can choose from but as I said you have to click on the verify your ID button and then follow the prompts accordingly. That's all it takes to verify your ID on Coursera. We hope the video was really helpful and if it did help you then make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel. If you've got any more questions feel free to leave them down. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon in our next video.